Well, hello, hello. How are you? Great to see you again. Good, Paul. How's things? Uh, doing wonderful. Thank you Great. so much. Good to and, see you again. Uh, we're, you too. We're so happy to see you on here today because, uh, you know, we've been talking to you since the beginning of this thing and it's just gotten better and better yeah, and, long time. And most, most, most series don't. Yeah. And, and so you must have felt some immense pressure, but obviously we're, we're well past that now and it's paid yeah. off. So you got to be feeling pretty good about everything. Um, right? Yeah. You know, it never, it never is quite all the way off. <laughs> Yeah, um, that's no, true. it's always a challenge, right? Cause like, it's never the pressure to, to go bigger or better or anything like that. It's just, you know, you want to challenge yourself and you don't want to let down your crew. You don't want to let down Keanu. You don't want to let the people that put it in. And I think that's also part of the magic. Like if you get the right crew, everyone's trying to, to expand and do something that's not the same, but kind of the same, but better. And not, like, I don't know, it's been a really good journey. So, yeah, well, and it might've felt a little bittersweet for you because it, you know, it was supposed to be the end, and you know, for a lot of fans too, they're thinking, "Ah, oh, is that it?" But as it turns out, it may not be over yet, right? <laughs> I, I think the, you know, I, you know how crazy it is to think that people want, you know, more of what you kind of think and do. And look, you'll never hear Ken and I go, "Ah, you know, John." Like, look, we love the world. If I could just work with Ken the rest of my life, I think that would be a blessing. I think what we do is really fun. If you saw the, you know, it's the hard work, right? You know, if your dreams are mountainous, you better love to climb. Yeah, I'm with a group of people that love the climb, man. They just they love the pain and suffering of filmmaking, so th that's kind of cool. But you also, you know, you don't want to over trump something. Like, we we love what we do, and if we have great ideas for John Wick, great. Uh, we have a lot of world building stuff that I think for other projects are going to be great. Um, but you know, Keanu and I, it's that bittersweet. You know, we love the character, we love the world, but also, you know, you want to you want to do John Wick right, and I think. We, we did the best ending possible for the character with what with what we had established. So very proud of that, but at the same time, a little sad, you know? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Well, it, you know, we've gone through what uh, my co-host, Drew Pearson, the great Dallas Cowboy, we yeah. call it the Hail Mary, what we call a Hail Mary moment, just going for this. And so, <laughs> uh, you know, most people we ask, what is your Hail Mary moment? But for this, uh, it must have been this, right? Um, it's just the choice, I guess. The Hail Mary moment is like, all right, unapologetically what's best for the franchise not what we feel not what's good for us like what's what's best for this character and then just committing you know it's that mm -hmm. you know that first day of shooting is like okay we're gonna put this one up but we gotta jump the shark or not um and we've done some pretty ridiculous stuff that's kind of worked in our favor i think so i don't know I, I i don't think you can ever lose the perspective of being an audience member we try to make what we'd like to see. We try to make what would make us laugh. We try to make what we think would be impressive. So we're never really chasing a review or a critique or, or a box office. You're just trying to, you know, entertain ourselves. And I think that's that's really the key. Yeah, but you're always trying to up the ante, and that's something that kind of you have to keep in mind. Uh, you know, have to have that sort of success mindset to do it. I think and that's you to, No, I get it. I think you just owe it to everyone to be better. The way, look, the biggest question we always get is, how do you go bigger? How do you uh, honestly? There's a there's that it's in the back of your head. You know, I'm not gonna lie to you that it's always there. But I think the way we looked at it was, Ken and I sat down and we got our 11 department heads and some of our other cast and went like, look, there's only one way to do this, and it's not gonna be with a set piece or action sequence. It's everyone's got to be a little better. I got to be a better director. Keanu's got to figure out something. Like, everybody's got to be better. And if everybody does that one inch better, collectively, we'll expand. And when you yeah. get a room full of people just going, fuck yeah, we're going to do this, then that's a pretty good, okay, we're in. And then you know you have your moment. You know? Yeah, well, you did it. Well, thank you so much for being with us today. We really, really course, appreciate no. everything. Appreciate the movie. Look forward to more from you soon. Thank you. Good to see you again. Thank Take you. care. Thank you so much. See you too. Bye-bye.